When it first opened in 1997, Cinemagic was the only movie theater in Athens. It has retained that title ever since it first projected film onto the big screen. As it brought some of Hollywood's films, the biggest Hollywood films, to life for the community. Like right now, they're showing the Jurassic Park movie. It's almost time for that theater to roll credits. News 19's Emily Mosner brings us details. For more than 20 years, Cinemagic has provided family entertainment, a good place for a date night, and so much more. But at the end of the month, it is closing its doors for good. When they make movies, they intended it to be shown on a big screen, not, not anything smaller. Ralph Freehoff is the owner of Cinemagic Theater in Athens. The theater opened in 1997 as a drive-in and expanded in 2006 to add five indoor auditoriums. Freehoff says there is nothing like a night at the drive-in. You can hear people in their cars laughing, or if this really sad movie, you can hear them crying. Or, or uh, but uh, it's uh, it's like sitting around a campfire and telling uh, ghost stories. But uh, I have the benefit of being able to show them visually how the story went. He says the reason for the closure is due to smaller crowds during the pandemic, and because it's just time for him to retire. I'm 75 now, and I should have retired. 10 years ago, I guess, when I turned 65. Freehoff says he's sad to be leaving Athens without a movie theater, but urges people to still go see films on the big screen. If you have to, go to either Decatur or Madison to see a movie on the big screen, because watching a movie any other place, uh, laptop, cell phone, uh, even on your TV, is not really watching a movie. Uh, there's so much more to get out of a movie if you can watch it on the big screen. While there's no good time to close the doors on a place that means so much, he says right now it feels like a full circle moment. Driving, we opened up with Jurassic Park and now we're closing up with the uh, newer version of the Jurassic Park. Now the owner says one of his favorite things about owning this business for so long is sticking his head in during a big scene in a movie and just watching people's reaction. Reporting in Athens, Emily Mosner, News 19. Uh, it makes me sad. Emily, I saw Frozen in that theater. <laughs> Freehoff says he's in contract with a buyer for the building and he's likely to turn it into a church. The last movie will be shown July 31st and you can find more about our conversation about the history of Cinemagic. We've made it easy for you. It's on WHNT.com.